Hello everybody and welcome back to GTA 5. Now, last weekend, or should I say the weekend just gone, uh, we went go-karting, me and a couple of my friends, and I always forget how freaking fun it is. It's only the second time I've ever been in my life, and uh, I came third place out of like nine people. So to me, a bit of a win. Uh, <laughs> nothing to brag about though. However, it did get me thinking as to whether or not you could get go-karts on Grand Theft Auto 5, which is, of course what this video is about. Now I remember in San Andreas there was uh, some go-karts you could get uh, just in single player mode you could find them somewhere on the map uh, but this they're not in GTA 5 they're just not. The only way you can possibly get them in there is via mods. Now obviously the mods uh, links are in the description. I'm gonna show you uh, a, a little bit of them right now this is my Washington sedan, by the way. I use the camber mod, um, and then I've changed the engine and stuff so it sounds like a rat rod. I don't know if you can um, hear how how cool that sounds. And I think it looks really cool. Anyway, let's get into our first go-kart. Here's our first one right here. Um, it's a standard-looking one, kind of like one of the ones I drove, except uh, the ones that I drove had a lot more metal caging around them, <laughs> in my opinion. Uh, but obviously, you're going to crash a lot. These, uh, this is a replacement mod, so what this actually does is it replaces the Dune, which is, uh, I think it's on the, like the buggy type thing. So obviously when you install this, you, you then can't use the Dune. It would be cool to know if there was any, um, if you could change the colour in the game maybe. Change the weather so it's extra sunny, there we go, we can even see it now. We're just going to go into the menu mod and just see if we can. Paint, primary, classic. Oh yeah, you can as well. That's pretty damn cool. So obviously that's that's actually the only thing. Because this is a replacement mod and not an add-on, the modifications that would actually be for this vehicle don't work on this vehicle. So if I could get... Well, there doesn't actually seem to be any mods anyway. Maybe you can't mod the Dune at all. See if we can actually lower it. Oh my god, you can. What? Why? Would you want to do that? I don't know. I know you could use the camber mod, which I installed the last time I played GTA and did a little uh, something something on it. Um, you can actually change the camber and stuff on it as well, which is pretty quick. The, the track width, I'd, I'd love like a really super wide one. Or we could have it like super, super narrow, so maybe it's super slick. Rear track width in. And you can... Turns crazy, because it does actually... Look, that, that's changed the handling a lot, actually. So then if we put the front ones back out... Is that any better? Yeah, you see that? That's pretty damn cool. Another thing you can could do with the menu mod um, doesn't really matter. Obviously, we can go through here and we can put the best engine upgrades, the best brakes, and everything on. But one thing you could do, which I love to do, is do the horsepower multiplier. Now, technically, you only have to multiply it by two, and that's doubled as fast as it will go. But I always put something stupid like 50 in. The same with torque. If you put 50 in, you're probably not actually going to be able to race it at all. So it does nothing but skids, <laughs> which is freaking cool as hell. But obviously, like that's the most fun. Oh my god! Jesus Christ! That's the most fun we can have with this one, because it's a replacement mod, there's not really much you can do with it. Obviously, like I say, you can change the engine sound, you can do all sorts. Oh, can we get under here? Oh, look, you can. Oh shit, that actually scared the crap out of me. Um, we do have one more go-kart mod that I can show you, and that is called the Supercart. The way we spawn this in those, we have to go into Vehicle Spawner, Input Model, and actually type in Supercart. Boom! And it's this bad boy. Now, this is actually from um, Project Cars, which if you haven't heard of it, it's a bit of a racing simulation game. I had it on Xbox One, I haven't got it on PC yet, but Project Cars 2 is coming soon, so I doubt I will. Basically the point of Project Cars is you can start out um, racing go-karts and slowly progress your career as such. There's no real, it's really not an arcade type game at all. Anyway, that's not what we're here for, we're here for the freaking go-karts. Um, this, I don't actually know if you can modify it, so we're going to go into the menu customs and have a look. It does look like you can. So obviously there's the wheels which we're not going to try because it may crush the game. Custom front bumper. Oh my god, you actually can. So we're going to have a little... I didn't actually expect this to be this long, I'm not going to lie. So, so the FS split. Oh, maybe you can't change it. Oh man, I really thought you could. Okay, it does actually look like nothing works. I, I have a feeling that maybe this isn't installed properly or something though. Because that's a lot of detail to be going into. I feel like these should actually all change. Supercart roof. Oh my god, I wish I had one. Obviously we can change the engine and stuff as well. So that actually does look like that we can't... Oh, that's really sad. I'm, kind of, I'm really sad that this doesn't work. I have a feeling that... I mean, I most definitely haven't installed it wrong, you know? Um, and can you do first person? So I was having a bit of an issue with my first person. Oh my god, look. What? 
This is actually a lot cooler than I thought it was, although you can't actually change anything. The way Franklin's hands line up to the wheels are actually pretty accurate. I, I figured they wouldn't be, because they're not in most add-ons, but, you know, it's not too bad. This thing actually has too much power. <laughs> I genuinely can't race it. Okay, so we're going to try and get around here as quick as we can. Right, here we go. Just going to do a quick lap. Um, there was also a, a go-kart track. Okay, maybe I want to go for that jump. Okay, let's, let's do that jump. Right, where is it? Where is it? I can't see it. I can't see it. Here it is. Whee! Oh my god. Ouch. 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 Imagine doing that in an actual go-kart. That'd be crazy. Um, I did come across a go-kart track, but I didn't have time to install it. So maybe uh, if this video gets enough attention and a little bit of love, then uh, we can install that and have a go on that and see what that's like. It'd be way more entertaining if you get more go-karts on the game, like some AI to be go-karts. Are we going to make it? Yes! We actually did! <laughs> what the hell? It'd be cool if you could get AI to race you in go-karts on, on the go-kart track, but that's one reason I didn't really want to go to all the effort of installing it, is because you can't, so it's a little bit pointless. But Race Around the Streets of Los Santos very much reminds me of Race Around the Streets of San Andreas back in the day of obviously San Andreas. I think that's where I'm going to leave this. Um, I, I would have liked this to be more modifiable. I might have a go at reinstalling it and just see. Um, I do also want to make a video on the go-kart track as well, just see what that's like. But yeah, for now, thank you very much for watching. If you like the video, hit thumbs up. If you like the videos, go and subscribe, and I'll see you in a bit.